Hey guys, it's Anthony with The Rag Company, and in today's video, we're telling you everything you need to know about Detail Factory brushes. So there is no denying that brushes are one of the most useful tools in automotive detailing. Next to a towel, they get used on everything from the interior to the exterior of a vehicle. Now in front of me are the Detail Factory brush lineup, and these are not just any ordinary brush. Detail Factory came into the detailing scene around 2017, and they came into it pretty strong because that's when they introduced the synthetic bristle brush. Now this is what caught our attention because it looked like something that came out of a makeup ad. Not only was it extremely soft, but it was perfect for delicate surfaces on the exterior and interior of a vehicle. Now, the first color they introduced was gray, and we said, hey, can you make that in TRC blue? And they said, we can do that. Hence why we came out with our blue version of the synthetic brush. Now, down the road, they said, hey guys, would you want something that has a little bit more scrubbing power? And we said, what do you have in mind? And that's when the boar's hair brush was introduced. So this is a bleached boar's hair brush that had better scrubbing capabilities and was better for agitating really dirty surfaces. This brush is fantastic, but it's almost too soft for certain jobs. This brush here gives us a scrubbing power and can also take one heck of a beating. And it only made sense that we made it in orange, so we have the BSU blue and orange colorway. So at this point, our synthetic brush and our boar's hair brush came in two different sizes. It came with the long handle version and the short handle version in both the synthetic and the boar's hair. So depending on how big or how small your hands are, you can choose which handle size works best for you. But what about the people with the really small hands? Is that, is, that a, is that a thing? Is that a thing? Bam! Detail Factory Mini Brushes. If they weren't small enough, they just got a little bit smaller. And these do look small in my hands, regardless of what people say or think. But here we go, guys. So we have a synthetic brush, and we also have the boar's hair brush. Now, what are these good for? They're so small. These are perfect for those really tight areas. Everything from your AC vents or where a panel meets another panel, let's just say on your door or on your dash. These are perfect for getting into those and have quite a bit of scrubbing power for how small they are. I really like the boar's hair because it is actually quite firm regardless of how thin the diameter is. Now this guy right here being so soft, which is perfect for more intricate emblems on the exterior of a vehicle. Now the problem with having this really fancy brush and this really bright colored white brush is that people felt bad about getting them dirty. They said, hey Anthony, I got these nice brushes, but I don't want to use them on anything dirty because it's going to show dirt. Do you guys have a brush that doesn't show dirt that is still just as well constructed as the Detail Factory brushes? And that's what I thought to myself, well, hey, black doesn't show dirt. Why don't we do that? Introducing the new TRC Black Edition Boar's Hair Brush. Now, what these are are an undyed boar's hair, meaning that they are just the natural color of the boar hair, which is black with a little bit of some brown hairs in between. Now, these guys right here are absolutely perfect for dirty jobs. Everything from wheel lugs to wheel cleaning to engine bay cleaning to door jams, these are pretty much ideal, and they come in both sizes, the long handle and the short handle. But that begs the next question. Anthony, why would I buy detail factory brushes when I can just buy some cheaper brushes or heck, even a makeup brush? Well, this is a question we answer quite a bit. And right off the bat, you're gonna notice that these aren't made out of wood. Now, the best part about that is that these aren't going to mold or anything like that that you would have with a wooden brush, especially if the brush lives in a bucket of water. So Detail Factory, the owners behind Detail Factory are detailers. These are guys that have a passion for detailing and built these around detailing use. So unlike a makeup brush, makeup brushes aren't chemically resistant, whereas this guy is. And then the boar's hair brush, this thing is probably the strongest, nicest boar's hair brush I have ever personally felt. Now, one cool trick about the Detail Factory brushes is that when they designed this handle, they actually made it to where it had a perfect 50-50 weight distribution at the grip. Wanna see what I mean? Check this out. Now, I'm not coordinated, but if I can do this, then you can do this. And I think that's pretty cool. 
So let's take a moment to talk about boar's hair brushes and where and why I would use them. Now, the difference between boar's hair and the synthetic brush is that these are much more stiff. These have a lot more scrubbing capabilities than this will pretty much ever have. So these in line with an all-purpose cleaner can do some serious work on the interior and exterior of a vehicle. I love using these on leather seats. I love using these on tougher areas around the engine bay to get to. And I also love them for my wheel lugs. Now, one fun fact about boar's hair is that it is normal for these to shed. Yes, that is a normal thing. These are a natural fiber. And when you glue them down, they're only gonna hold so well. So if you see a few loose strands, not to worry, that is totally normal. Typically within the first couple uses of using a boar's hair brush, you will see a couple strands fall out. But just like a lot of other tools, there is a break in period. And once you get it completely worked in, that's when it should stop shedding and you should really see the max use out of the boar's hair brush. Now, briefly talking about the synthetic brush, what are the ways and areas that I would use this? This is primarily gonna be used on really delicate surfaces. And I mean really delicate. Do you guys know that piano black trim that some cars have on the interior that scratches just by looking at it? This does not scratch that. Seriously, it doesn't. I've tested it myself and this is so soft that it is perfectly safe on piano black trim when it comes to dusting or cleaning it out with an all-purpose cleaner or interior cleaner. Now, the other areas I like to use this on is paint. Paint is a big thing where you do need to use a brush from time to time to get in between emblems or scrub areas that you can't get to with a towel. And that's where this brush comes into play. It is so soft that it's not gonna scratch or mar your paint if you have proper lubrication from a soap or some type of exterior cleaner. Now, I really dig this brush. And this is the brush that got us hooked onto Detail Factory brushes in the first place. And now I know I've already talked about the mini brushes, but I wanna dive into the uses just a little bit more. So have you ever gotten to an area on a car where there was a crack or crevice that was really hard to get into? And I mean, so small that even your smallest brush you had couldn't get into it. That's where these come into play. They are extremely useful for those tight areas. If you're doing a concourse level detail or if you're very OCD, these are the brushes that you wanna have on hand. The boar's hair is extremely stiff and does have some scrubbing power, whereas the small intricate one right here is ideal for exterior emblems that are a little tighter and a little bit more complex. But having all of the lineup, you will use them. I promise you, you will use brushes. They are a tool and they're one of the most useful tools in automotive detailing. And one thing I did forget to mention was that if you want to clean these brushes, the best way to clean them is run them through some water, hang them upside down and let them hang dry. And there you guys go. So coming to an end here, I'm gonna leave you guys with this. Detail factory brushes were made for detailers by detailers. These things are chemically resistant. These things are perfectly weighted with a 50-50 weight distribution. They have a hang handle, and yeah, there are cheaper brushes out there. There's cheaper synthetic brushes, there's cheaper boar's hair brushes, but trust me, spending a little more will get you into a high quality brush that doesn't just last weeks, doesn't just last months, but should last you a year, if not more. These brushes have proven themselves, and we are super proud to offer them here at the Rad Company. So if you guys like this video, make sure you give us a big thumbs up, subscribe down below for more, and stay tuned for more videos right here at the Rad Company.